A Tucson man accused of luring a minor for sex on the internet is out of jail, awaiting his next court date. And Tucson police are urging you to keep a close eye on what your child is doing online so they don't become victims. Here is Nine on Your Side's Marcelino Benito with an important story, especially for parents. TPD got their perp. 24 year old Alexander Zumat, thanks to mom and her close eye on Facebook. Had mom had not have done that, we don't know what direction this would have gone. Zumat allegedly arranged to meet a 13 year old girl for sex. He was going to pay her. He pretended to be younger. We found this derogatory post against women on his Facebook page. I look at expletive like a buffet. Which one do I eat first? He wrote. A site like Facebook allowed him access to any girl he wanted, and it was just some keystrokes and a few mouse clicks away. They know how to do that. They know how to say the right things, find girls they think might be vulnerable. Jerry Payton helps rescue child sex abuse victims. He says predators are lurking online, even as you watch this story. You can't let your youth have unobserved access to the Internet. And it's not just Facebook anymore. Online games, chat rooms, Twitter, even websites designed for kids, the top places experts say where creeps are cruising for children. Parents don't want to have to be police, but in order to protect our children now, parents have to do this or the police will never find out. And that could put your child at risk. Now we should mention I did speak momentarily with Alexander's mother. She did not want to comment on any of this. Meanwhile, TPD tells me they are concerned there are more victims out there. They know from the suspect, suspect himself that he has spoken with other children on Facebook. So Jennifer, they're urging all parents tonight to check with their kids and if they have, call 911 or 88 crime. You've got to be on top of it. I mean, as a parent, it is scary, but you really have to know what your kids are doing all the time. And we posted extra information on our website on how parents can prevent stuff like this. Very good. Marcelino, thanks.